Hey, John Schuster, Cobalt Banker Burnett. We're continuing our Community Spotlight Series. Super excited for this one. Today, we're at Unmap Brewery here in Minnetonka. We're gonna go inside and meet the owner, JD. Check out this fine establishment. They have a bunch of Belgian and stateside ales, plus a bunch of other beers to try. So let's go inside and check it out. All right, so we're here inside checking this place out. Pretty darn cool, great to meet you. Yeah, great to meet you as well, thanks for being here. So, how the heck did you get involved in starting a brewery? <laughs> get asked that a lot, um, <laughs> and uh, it's a good question, but so, so when I met my wife way back in college, uh, she had an idea of opening her own business, and she kind of infected me with that mentality, and so when I moved up here with her, she's from Minnetonka, born and raised, I'm from the South, but I followed her up here, as many people who are here in Minnesota <laughs> usually do, they follow their spouse up here. Um, and uh, so she, you know, we were working our corporate jobs and she was just happy with it, but I could not shake the desire to open my own business. And I was really passionate about beer. I go to tap, went to tap rooms and breweries all the time and I was home brewing at the time. I don't brew any of the beer here though. Right. Just gonna put that out there. <laughs> you got some we professional brew masters very, in the back, yes, right? Yes, we do. Yeah, we have a really good team back there, uh, a lot of experience, but, uh, but all those passions kind of combined and over a long period of time of raising money and developing a business plan and all of that stuff, it, you know, takes some time. Right. Uh, Unmapped came to fruition around uh, June of 2017. when we uh, finally opened our doors to the public and started selling. We only had two beers on tap when we started, but now, of course, we have uh, 13 beers in a, in a hard sell. Wow, right this place is absolutely amazing. If you haven't been out to this tap room, you gotta check it out. All right, uh, what are the top four beers? Yes, yeah, so in your opinion. <laughs> well, our, our biggest seller, of course, is No Trace IPA. IPAs are huge, uh, but we also have some really fantastic Belgian beers that I stand by. Uh, our quad, our Belgian quadruple, which is nice, dark, strong Belgian beer. It's a unique beer, and it's delicious. And if you've never had anything like it, uh, I'd recommend giving it a try. It's really fun. But of course, uh, we have a really nice light beer selection. Um, with our Topo Wit, uh, which is a Belgian style wheat beer. And then um, also our Purgatory Pilsner won uh, Best Light Lager at the Minnesota Brewers Cup this year. So we're very proud of our uh, Pilsner beer as well. That's awesome. We're gonna have a link to the website. You gotta check it out. There's like 50 places in the Twin Cities you can access and try this beer, but you gotta come to the tap room and try them all out. All right, so we're seeing tap rooms kind of all across the Twin Cities and across the nation. What makes this place so special? Well, I mean, a lot of things that we do here are what other breweries do, but we do it, I think, very well. We have a lot of variety of beer, so if you're not into Belgian beer, that's okay. We've got lots of IPAs. If you don't like IPAs, well, we've got sour beers, or we've got lagers. Uh, we have hard seltzer now if you have some gluten sensitivities. Cool. Um, so we try to keep our beer uh, very very uh, much uh, beers that people we know like, but also we rotate through. Kind of try some new things. stuff. We have through. a beer that's uh, Trace Leche's cake beer right now. Uh, <laughs> I'm gonna try that one off camera once for now. Delicious. <laughs> it's kind of like a cream soda almost, but but yeah. So we try to keep variety uh, mixed up and uh, and moving, uh, but also keep the favorites on tap. But we also, you know, we cater to a lot of variety of, of people demographics. We're very family friendly here. We're very dog friendly here. If you're not a beer drinker, an alcohol drinker, uh, you don't have to drink alcohol here. This is a not a bar, it's a gathering place, a community awesome. place, and that's what we're trying to go for. Well, that's what this series is about, our Community Spotlight Series. We want you to love where you live and try new establishments in the area. The great thing, they have food trucks that come here all the time. So if you're in the area in Minnetonka, you gotta check it out. We're gonna put a map here for you to take a look at. Thank you so much oh, for sitting out here, yeah, standing with us today, yeah, and come check it out. And again, John Schuster Group, we'll see you soon.